Welcome to another video from Dr. Locke. This ugly alien looking piece of aluminium is an absolute nightmare to remove. This is what we call a oil pump on a 4DCB Hyundai engine. Now I've got to remove it. Okay, the update. So here we are, day two. Um, I finished off yesterday afternoon by getting the pump out. So that's this section down here. As you can see, it is out. Where does it live now? It lives around here somewhere. Anyway, I've got a new one of them coming. Um, I've got a new timing chain set coming. There was a lot of noise coming from the top here, and I don't know if it had anything to do with the timing chain up the top here, but it really was seeming to be coming like from here. Uh, we're putting it down to lack of lubrication, but for 128 bucks, I'm changing this timing chain and the tensioner, and we're going to see if that makes any difference while I'm here. Um, I've got all my timing marks lined up and all that, so it should be okay. But yeah, um, did manage to get out the pump down below. That was the biggest nightmare. In the book, it says if you've got uh, high oil pressure, low oil pressure, basically replace pump, for sure. But they don't explain on how much of a kind of a job it is. Had I've known, um, you know, what was involved, I would have pulled the motor to do it. But it didn't say that. It says remove timing gear, remove this, remove that. Basically, it would have been easier to pull the motor and do it than the way I had to do it. Um, I had to remove all the front, all the timing gear, and then um, the engine mounts as well, because it just wasn't giving up. Even though I could get it out, I couldn't get it out from under here. So I had to jack up the motor for 50 mil clearance or 40 mil clearance so I could actually slide it out. Where is the, where is it? It's here somewhere. I've got it here somewhere. I haven't chucked it out. I haven't chucked it out. I definitely have it here somewhere. There it is. There it is there. So to get that part out is ridiculous. I wish they had said, you know, from the beginning, that's a motor out job. And then I would have said, okay, let's tackle it that way. But in the book, it just says replace. It doesn't say which way to tackle it. So unfortunately, that's uh, where we're up to now, waiting on the parts. And then we're going to put it all back together. And then we're going to see how it sounds. Fingers crossed, it'll sound good. One of the things that I was uh, quite happy with uh, was my drain that I've put down here. I've dropped oil, I've dropped coolant, and I've been able to just clean it down each time and send it down the drain, which keeps the floor clean and non-slippery. All right, next update shortly.